Amy Comey Barrett. Supreme Court hearings. The nonsense. The crazy questions they were asking her. They were looking for anything to stick on her. Anything. We even had ridiculous questions like and accusations by senators like Maisie Haroni that said that Amy Comey Barrett was being offensive because she used the word sexual preference. Like that term was ever offensive to the LGBT community. And what's crazy, how we know that we're living in a crazy borderline socialist society is that right when Maisie Hirona asked that question, the dictionary, Webster's Dictionary, changed the definition of sexual preference to match what Maisie Horoni accused Amy Comey Barrett of. Bro, bruh, that's crazy. That's crazy. I've never seen such a wholesome person like Amy Comey Barrett, who has seven kids, well, nine, and she adopted two kids from, two black kids from Haiti and has a great marriage, and she is exactly kind of like what feminists are fighting for. The picture of a woman who's not dominated by her husband, who obviously is wearing their pants in a relationship, who has a successful career and has kids and is giving back to the black community by adopting black kids. And now she's being vilified because of her religion, because she's Catholic and she's Christian and she doesn't, she's pro-life. She's pro-life. That doesn't mean she's going to banish or uh, undo Roe v. Raid just because she's pro-life. Just because she stated that. And just because she has traditional views and a lot of things. Wow. This is insane, y'all. This is why you cannot vote for the Democrats. They're out of their mind. The Democratic people in power are crazy. And they believe the craziest things. Like gender doesn't exist. <laughs> like sexual preference is offensive. Just a term. Crazy times, y'all. That's all I got to say. <laughs>